The Ryan Raiders walk into the fourth round looking like a team that is confident in their abilities. And they should be. The Raiders are many people's number one option to win a state title. But it will take action on the field to make that a reality. Action like this. Spencer Sanders hits Gabriel Douglas in stride for the 24-yard touchdown. Raiders lead 7-0. But the offense goes into a little bit of a funk after that. It's not a big problem because the Ryan defense has their back. Ernest Brown and the Raiders dominate the first three quarters and hold Colleyville Heritage scoreless. In the third, the offense gets going again. Ryan scores on a play that looks very familiar. Sanders to Douglas again, just like the first touchdown of the day. That caps a nine minute drive to start the second half. It's 17 nothing Ryan and the Raiders are in complete control. We kept our defense off the field and, and we gave them a break and giving them a break and keeping them rested is a great thing because then they can come out full speed ready to go and if we stay on the field and take time off the clock and score at the same time, I mean you might as well say put in the books. The Raiders do put it in the books in the fourth. Jake Sparks gets the block to spring Tyreek Davis. Davis's touchdown locks it down. Ryan wins 24 to 10 and they know what's next. On to the semifinals, baby! That's what we do out here! Not 5 nine. I'm very happy for our kids. They've worked so hard and they've done a great job. There was very high expectations on these kids coming into the season. And for them to uh, just pretty much stay in the moment and go day by day and enjoy each other and enjoy the process of uh, this season and get into the semifinals now is a, is a credit to them. It's a credit to our coaching staff. And so I'm happy for them. I'm happy for our school and, and of course, the, the community of Denton. 14 and 0, baby. 14 and 0. We got each other's back. We, I, I would die for anybody in that locker room. I don't care if they do something wrong. I'll pick them up at 3 o'clock in the morning. I will die for those teammates in there. So I will play my heart out, give it all I got for that other side because I know they would do the same for me.